My children, it's time for the daily bread. We're continuing with Zechariah, still prophesizing um, in front of the, the people and uh, in front of his son, John. So let's hear today's track. Daily track 613, Luke chapter 1, verse 76 through 79. And you, child, shall be called the prophet of the Most High, for you will go before the face of the Lord to prepare his ways and to give knowledge of salvation to his people for the remission of their sins. Through the heart of mercy of our God, by which descending from on high, he visited us to illuminate those who sit in darkness and in the shadow of death and to direct our feet in the way of peace. Kids, so there is a lot going on here. So first of all, he's going to be called the prophet of the most high. So John is. And what that means is he's going to be going before the Lord. In other words, to prepare uh, the people for Jesus. And so he's going to be having his ministry beforehand um, so that Jesus, as he um, gets ready for Jesus, he'll have everything kind of laid out there, kind of like setting the table. And um, so the other thing here, which is interesting, is you got to remember the Jewish people have been making animal sacrifices for a long time. And um, that those animal sacrifices, that's how they were taught to have forgiveness of sins. And so instead of the sacrifices now, it says that the Savior will be the one um, providing the salvation. And it's not going to be the animals anymore. It's going to be the Savior that helps, um, you know, save us from our sins. And the other thing is it talks about like the shadow of death. What's the wages of sin, right? The penalty of sin is death. And so um, he will, this the Savior will pull us um, out of the shadow of death, right? He, he frees us from sin and um, brings us to peace and joy, right? That's, that's what being saved means. You're saved from um, certain damnation and you're, you're going to be a part of God's family. God bless. I love you.